We have a Saturday 1 p.m. tilt uh, with Old Rochester visiting Case, and if the Bulldogs want to repeat as the A Division champs in the South Coast Conference, they sure did start off on the right foot. Granted, it was against a non-conference team, but yeah. uh, they, they had one heck of an offensive performance all the way out there in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, you know, it, that, that long trip out to, to Lee definitely did not tire the uh, Bulldogs. They put seven touchdowns on the scoreboard. Uh, all of them were rushing touchdowns. Two from Darian Dumont, two from Alex Arori, and two from Ethan Lizot, and one more from Mike Morris. So, you know, that ground attack just dominated, um, you know, at Lee High School uh, this past Friday. And Alex Arori, his first start at quarterback, he completed two of three passes for 73 yards. So pretty good showing. Right. Both, I mean, both passes that he completed were big shots. So. Yeah. So, I mean, you got to be happy about that. But uh, it sounds like, you know, the Bulldogs are going to be, a, you know, a running team this year, which is fine. You know, they've, they've proven they, they can get the job done. Well, too, part of the, the issue with this game, too, is the starters only went into the third first series of the third quarter. Yeah. Too. So when you have that big of a lead, you, you're kind of going to run anyway because you don't want to run up the score too much. Yeah. So... We might see something a little bit different depending on the situation of the game, but yeah. they definitely do have a great stable of uh, backs. Yeah. Well, and then they're facing a case team that, that lost to Seekonk last week, and Seekonk, you know, put a ton of points on the board. They scored uh, 48. You know, Case did end up scoring 27, you know, the Cardinals themselves, but, um, you know, it was really just kind of a... I think Case really came out strong in that first half. They had 20 um, points in the first quarter. They actually led 27 to 26 at halftime and um, they had two fumbles in the second half that really cost them and they weren't able to score at all they got shut out in the second half so we'll see how um, you know case comes out this week you know at home you know it's they're gonna be at home um, you know and it's a even though it's the South Coast, South Coast Conference game it's you know case is a B division team or Rochester is a division team so you know it doesn't really affect the conference standings in that sense but you know it'll be good for for old Rochester to play a little bit close Closer to home, you know they're still on the don't road. To, don't have to drive three hours to get up there. Yeah, so that game Saturday one o'clock at Case. So. Uh, and the, taking the bus to Case, you don't have to bring chewing gum because your ears won't pop. <laughs> All right, so you can follow us on Twitter at sc underscore varsity.